great to welcome back to the Harvey Norman Lounge best-selling author and naturopath, Lani Lopez. Good morning, Lani. Good morning, Mel. So we're here to talk today about something that can be really painful and debilitating, uh, shingles. Yes, and um, it can affect children, teenagers, adults. It's, a, it's more of a nervous immune system illness. So what, so what exactly is it? It um, comes from the chickenpox family, or um, you won't like this, but the herpes family. Oh, okay. And uh, it works on uh, the nerves. So it's a virus that gets inside the nerve, and when our immune system's low, it rushes out, and it causes lots of blisters, and they're very, very painful, and then it rushes back in. So it's quite hard to kind of nab. So you can get reoccurring bouts of it ongoing? If your immune system's really low, you can, or you can get it once when you're three, and then again when you're 16, you think, wow, what's wrong with me? I always thought it was something that you got as an adult after you had chicken pox as a child. I think um, the onset as an adult is a lot more common than it um, being a kid, but um, you can get something called post hepatic pain. So, as an adult or an older adult, once they go away, you can get this very bad nerve pain along the lines of the nerves that the shingles have come out and they've gone. And, oh. you, and you think, oh, I must be mad, it really hurts. And there are things to help with that too. And it can be quite excruciating, can't it? Very, very painful. So, how do you go about treating it? Okay, so um, what I do is I look at, um, first of all, going to see the GP because uh, shingles can go into your eye in your mouth mm. and places like that and they will cause complications so and we don't want that no and um, but um, normally it's sort of around the face around the eyebrow and the tri trigeminal nerve it sort of cradles the face and around the torso and uh, I use Ollie up now Ollie up is a fantastic formula that is designed to support the body's immune system have a look at this one that's right and can I play with these you can Good. yeah thank you so um, normally I just take one a day to help support you know the immune system but if you're at this level of actually having shingles um, you can look at taking about six a day and you combine it with lysine now lysine is an amino acid that's really low in the body when you do have shingles and I always recommend if you do have shingles don't eat meat or cheese because that has a lot of this amino acid called arginine and that can trigger off the shingles so and you balance it out by having this lysine and you know I saw this go before and it's just fantastic. Wow it's um, a huge pill. It is and you, and you have to take six Really? Yep. Or if you are they um, light though? Having said that, if yeah, they are light. But these are good if you have cold sores as well. Are you prone to cold Same sores? Same thing. Shingles, cold sores, chicken pox, um, herpes type two. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. All those pleasant things. Yeah, so and and um, it's really about balancing the amino acids. But so you balance those, and then you make sure you're supporting the immune system. And I've got a black moors vitamin C with horseradish, just get a lot of vitamin C and zinc into the system. You can see that I'm not biased towards anything, mm. just use what you've got and help yourself get rid of it. I do have shingles on my website and a lot of, it's one of the top uh, chapters that people go to when they come to my website. So you should avoid food like meat and cheeses while yep. you've got shingles. Yep, full of arginine and you don't want that, you want lysine. Okay, lysine is a good one. And is there anything else you can do to help yourself out if you're in this position? So just remember the six grams of that, um, six capsules of the Ollie Up, and you can have baths with lemon balm. So if you've got any lemon balm tea, you can actually just soak it in the bath and just lie in there or whatever part is affected on your body, and that actually helps with your nervous system. And St John's Wort okay. is really, really good for shingles as well. That's quite calming, isn't it? Well, at, um, at this point, we just want to get rid of the blisters um, when they sort of come and pop up and we want to make the frequency go down because some people, it can actually affect every month. Oh, that would just be awful. The main and thing is get that immune system nice and, and strong. And really, yeah, boost up that immune system. That goes for everything, though, doesn't it? Pretty much. Thanks so much, Lani.